Good evening, my name is Ryan Washundi, and I'll be performing an original speech titled, Give Us a Break, Free Periods for Middle Schoolers. In 2012, a study done on secondary school children recorded that 70% of these children exhibited moderate to severe stress levels. And as of 2012, the leading cause of stress is too much to do. That is exactly what is happening in middle schools today. Ever since this has become an issue, solutions have been arriving by the truckload. For example, less homework or shorter school days. But I'm here today to tell you that is not we what we remove from the system, is what we add. I believe that sc every school should have a free period, not just a study hall, but a time where a student can opt to relax. Relax, listen to music, read a book, play a quiet game, or just nap. It's a similar concept to recess in elementary school in that you get a time to cool down, let off some steam. But obviously, more productive things can be done with this. For example, a teacher's job is to teach the whole class, not just a, a particular student. During this period, a student can go to the teachers and talk about lessons that they may have missed or they don't fully understand to gain that individual help everybody needs. But some students want to do even more with this period, which is understandable. I wouldn't want to sit on my butt for an hour. Clubs and other extracurricular activities can and frankly should be held during this period not only in the D.C. metropolitan area, but all over the country. Juvenile crime rates have been shown to be significantly lower in places with schools with extracurricular activities. Having these extracurricular activities in schools will make space for not only more clubs and extracurricular activities, but more time for homework and projects. And more time for homework and projects means more time for rest. And more time for rest means you're well rested and have a lesser chance of getting stressed out. My school, Greenmount Middle, has had something like this system implemented and will be removed next year. So I urge parents, students, and teachers to petition and have this not only brought back in my school, but in every school, not just in PG, not just in Maryland, but all over the country. So please, give us a break. Thank you.